and friendship and you know all, all these good things and I think it's really special when you can find someone that you want to spend the rest of your life with not only someone that you can be friendly with but someone you want to share the rest of your life with and I think that's really special and really rare so guys you've got it and I'm so happy for you early July 1984 it was one of my proudest days of my life there's no question about that I was there I was there but I didn't see it I may ask you and now to be honest I've just blinked and we're sat here today which is 39 years later <laughs> She doesn't look 39, I'll be honest with you. Oh, it, 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 must be, it must be Tracy that's 39 now. Oh. I can firmly say you haven't just married my daughter but you've invested the rest of your life into Katie's dance and everything that goes with it. And to be honest, I've seen the little videos and you're into it, I know that. <laughs> I've seen you, Joseph and all that, I've seen it. I think you've been with Katie long enough now to know what you're lending yourself in for. During the time we have known Nick, we have come to realise how special he is. He's gained a special friend in our Leila who thinks the world of him, is likeable, supportive in more ways than one, and anyone can see that they're made for each other. when being told off. Dad, I'm not a child. It's a way parents protect their children. Well, it's strange, but for the first time ever, Katie, I do agree, you have grown into the most beautiful young lady to be. And stood by Nick today makes both your mum and me proud. So, please join in for our final toast to Nick and Katie on their special day. Could you please be upstanding? And it's quite simply, Nick and Katie. Nick and Katie. Thanks very I much. Upon I call upon these persons here present. These persons here present. To witness the tie. To witness the tie. Nicholas James Payne. Nicholas James Payne. Do take thee. Do take thee. Katie Louise Reedman. Katie Louise Reedman. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. Today I stand by you. Happy and proud. Happy and proud. Of the special love we have for each other. Of the special love we have for each other. Today we celebrate. Today we celebrate. All that lies ahead. All that lies ahead. I promise to love, cherish and respect you. I promise to love, cherish and respect you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I pledge to you faithfulness and friendship. I pledge to you faithfulness and friendship. In good times and bad. In good times and bad. From this day. From this day onwards. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my endless love for you. As a symbol of my endless love for you. All that I am, and all that I have, and all that I have, I bring to you. I bring to you. May this ring remind us of this moment. May this ring remind us of this moment. And the commitment I have made to you. And the commitment I have made to you. On behalf of my wife and I, 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 on beh
guys, thank you all for coming here today and sharing our special day with us. You made me happier than I ever dreamed I could be. I intend to spend the rest of my life making sure that I can be as happy as I am. The minute I turned around today and saw it at the end of the aisle, you took my breath away. You've never been as beautiful to me today. You've never been as beautiful to me as you are today. I hate what looks good. Not only are you my wife, but my best friend, my confidant, and easily the best thing that's ever happened to me. You know, to pick me up when I'm down, and you always seem to have the right words when I've had a bad day. Without you in my life, I really don't know where I'd be. So with that being said, please can you all be upstanding and raise your glass in a toast to my wife, Katie. <laughs> My first memory of Nick is we used to play um, What Time Is It, Mr. Wolf, in the garden. And whenever the wolf would say, Dinner time! Nick would leg it to the end of the garden, hide in a hedge, and cry like a little baby. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's true. Another time at secondary school when, for some unknown reason, Nick decided he wanted to fight me. Um, <laughs> do you remember? With what felt like 500 kids screaming for blood. Fight, fight, fight. Unfortunately, what really happened was probably the most underwhelming, pathetic attempt at a fight you've ever seen. It basically consisted of two boys kind of stood like this, just holding each other for what? <laughs> felt like half an hour, but it was probably about 20 seconds <laughs> until some school prefect pulled us apart. Um, we shook hands afterwards, both agreed that I won, and then <laughs> went on our merry way home. <laughs> Over the years, I've called Nick's kind of every name you can think of, probably some you can't. But the one word I would describe Nick is loyal. And anyone that knows him will know that's true. You're always there, mate. Whenever anyone needs anything, no questions asked, you're there. And I think Janet and Colin should be very proud of the man that you've raised. It's funny how the story is told 
You really think I'll get puns for a wedding gift? <laughs> we do need some new puns. I want to get you a wedding gift that would be something that we could cherish forever. You always say to me you never live once in front of a camera, so I haven't listened and followed your advice for once. So, Mr. Payne, we off on a venture together, just the two of us, to make some of your bucket list come true. On the 22nd of October 2023, we are flying to New York, where we'll spend three days in the beautiful suite on Times Square, exploring the city together and living life without looking through a lens. There's no one else I want to go through life's adventures with. Time to make life happen. Happy wedding day.